Good evening and welcome to 200forexpips.com. I am here with the final analysis of 13th of November 2018. Okay guys, uh, we have seen a slow day bit trading. However, um, we have taken some trades that went as per the signals report and I am going to discuss about those trades. So let's get started with Euro USD. This is the first signal of my signals report and Euro USD with a bullish expectation from 112501 and the target price was 113286 and guys, uh, you can see even with the slow momentum today, we have hit the signal and euro usd has finally went up from the entry so those traders who have taken the buy positions from here because if you look at this candle this candle was closed above the entry so there was a very good chance to take a buy position on euro usd and they must have taken the very good profits okay a strong momentum is seen today on great britain pound jpy it has went up um, straight and 146867 was the bullish entry and 147909 was the target price so guys we have seen a big upward trend on the price and you can clearly see that Great Britain Pound JPY has moved up. So guys be careful about this because uh, the price has moved up so we will uh, go for another signal tomorrow and we will see that either we are going to sell this pair or still we uh, remain bullish on this pair so we will decide tomorrow and right now it's not a good option to trade Great Britain Pound JPY at this level. Okay now let's talk about Euro JPY. I'm going to take you towards the uh, chart here. Okay guys uh, with the slow momentum and you can see uh, that it has given us a bullish trend 128258 was the bullish entry and guys you can see the entry is break like uh, four to five hours ago and it has made a little bullish pattern however the market is slow so we have not seen that most of the pairs have not hit the target price due to the slow momentum so overall if you have traded euro jp by from here to uh, like four to five hours then you must have collected the good profit now let's talk about AUD JPY. So guys, uh, this signal was uh, 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 this signal. First of all, it was bent uh, bearish as per the expectation, but later on, it again move up from the entry. So guys, if it breaks the level A to one two six, then again it will be into the bearish zone, and the target price is eight one six two one. Okay, now let's talk about the strength that we have seen today on USD Canadian dollar. It's going up from some days and still it's keeping the bullish momentum. 132289 was the bullish entry. And guys, you can see that right from the entry, USD Canadian dollar has made the bullish, uh, bullish pattern. And like 70% of the signal was expired uh, in the previous uh, four hours. And if you have traded this one, then you must have collected the profit. Okay, now let's talk about the USD CHF. So guys, um, I have supplied the bearish trend in case of USD CHF 100945 was the bearish entry and 100534 is the targeted price and guys you can see the entry was break uh, 3 hours ago and if you have traded the 2 hours then you must have taken the profit right now it's making the bullish pattern but again if it goes uh, if it keeps its level below 100945 then it is completely into the bearish zone at last I'm going to talk about uh, another slow momentum that we have seen today on New Zealand USD. It has gone nowhere. Mostly the market has kept itself in a range. So bullish trend was supplied to the subscribers in the morning from 067500 and you can see that we have a break here. But right now again it's uh, somewhere in the middle but overall the market went into the range throughout the day and right now uh, two hours ago it has uh, made a bullish trend but still it's above the entry. So yeah, until unless it keeps itself above the entry then it's in a bullish zone if the entry is breaks and if it closes below then it will be back into the bearish zone okay guys uh, uh this is about the signals and moreover if you uh, are new to the trading channel let me explain about the trading system whenever you see that the pair is into the top red boundary and it starts making the bearish pattern you can sell the pair as a trading system and whenever you see that the market came into the lower red boundary and, and if it makes the bullish pattern from here then you can buy the pair and this is how we use the trading system so guys this is all about the today's analysis so if you are looking to subscribe to my daily forex signal service if you want to get these trading indicators, if you want to improve your trading technique through my video lessons or you want to request for Skype one-to-one -one live coaching for all these, please send your inquiries on info at the rate of 200 for Please like my video, subscribe my YouTube channel and share the analysis with other traders. Thank you for watching the video.